Ariel and in this video it's going to be a how to survive the rest of the school year video. So um, this video is basically just going to be a few tips um, on how to basically get through the rest of the school year without having like so many problems like detentions or failing quizzes or bad grades, just stuff like that and how to make life a lot easier for you at school and if you guys like this video, then give it a thumbs up, and if you are new to this channel, hi, I'm Ariel, and um, it'd be awesome if you can click that subscribe button down below. By the way, thank you guys for 90 subscribers. Um, I think we hit it like two days ago, so that was pretty awesome. And, um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Bye. <laughs> Let's So my first tip for you guys is to basically take the best notes possible. Um, lately I've been writing down everything my teacher has to say and writes down on the board. And that's been helping me a lot when I take quizzes because we're allowed to use our notes. And before I would kind of just like listen, write down whatever I want, whatever I heard. But obviously that's not helping because yeah, let's just say I'm not very good at math. And, um, just take the best notes. If you need to, color code, but honestly, I don't think that's going to help you. The, the main thing that's going to help you is writing down the information that you need to know, not spending five minutes highlighting the most important information. You do not need highlighters to study, just so you know. for you which you should probably already know and do all the time is um to write down your homework and I understand like sometimes I forget to write down my homework like a lot of the time I forget to so hopefully your teacher has like a website or a school website that you can go to to like copy your homework because my school has that which is really useful because I am the most forgetful person ever like if there is something that I really want. I am not going to forget that, I promise. But if it's something like, oh, remind me to um, teach a lesson about this, Ariel, or remind, or if my mom's telling me to not forget to do laundry, I'm most likely going to forget that because I don't want to do that. But with homework, it's kind of like I need to do that, but I don't want to. So I, you can forget most of the time, so hopefully your teacher has a website that you can go to to get your homework from. Something that's really important is being organized and just knowing what you have to do and like putting in order sometimes. For me, it's always filming, editing, and homework. That is the main thing for me right now. Um, and yeah, it's going to be the same for everyone, but I just suggest making like a list, um, maybe on a whiteboard, a piece of paper, in a journal, um, maybe where you write your homework down, because you're probably going to see that every day. So something that I recommend you guys doing is asking questions to your teacher. Don't be afraid, um to get the question wrong too if you want to participate because that's just going to help you learn and grow more. So if you keep answering the question right, that's good. Uh, that means you know the information, but you're not really learning anything anymore because you already know that. But if you answer a question that you don't understand, most likely your teacher will tell you the que that what you answered is wrong and then she's going to show you how to get the um, so, I hope you guys enjoyed that video, and, um, yeah, I hope you guys use these ideas, and I hope they help you a lot. Um, yeah, uh, bye guys!